Hey Shona, it's just a 12.30 in the morning. I'm working on the um, the parts. So I've taken all the parts that are 3, 3A and 3B. I've put them here. And the bending that was done in the following folder, I'll show you in the following folder. It was done in the folder. Right here you can see it. G, Venscape, 1203.21, Woodbine, Casino panel, aluminum perforated plasma bending, engineering AP3. I put everything into this folder, okay? And I've looked at the bending. I've tried to do my own bending, but the bending, whoever did the bending, did already the best that, that can be done. It was here March the third, sorry, March the 10th. You see this one here? So this one here is already good. Here's my own, I, and I couldn't improve. I actually made it worse. So, I put the three flats here, and the three flats are, when you overlay them, they're all the same bends. That's the nice part about it. They're all the same bends. You can see the colors overlay, the three different colors. Uh, the whole patterns are the same. By that I mean these two holes here and here all overlap. All the bend lines overlap. Um, obviously, on one of the parts, the 3B and the 3A, the notches are on the opposite sides, right? Here's on the left side, here's on the right side, and then three has no notches. But the point I want to make is the holes overlap. So if you make a if you make a template that um, you get these holes here, watch, I'll show you. If I take this and I let's copy this. And I mirror it. Mirrored. The bend lines don't match. The bend lines, um, they don't match at all. See all these bend lines here. The bend lines on the exterior match here. They're pretty. They're pretty close on the the sides, but all the other bend lines don't here. So you you go from you go from this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve bends here. Does it so so the point I'm trying to make is this. Um as long as the holes I see the problem is Shona is the holes here, the holes here are the same, even when you flip it. This hole with this hole here, and same thing with the holes down here. These guys you can't tell them apart, and these guys here you can't tell them apart. So they've got to count the parts properly. The three, the three, the three A, and the three B. Does that make sense? They can't. Uh, they need to look which ones have been cut from the top, which ones have been cut from the top as well. You know, from the plasma you can tell which is the top and which is the bottom. So when they pay it to the press break, you can see here. Um, just let's change some colors here. These two, these two angles are negative, so they should be changed to, let's say, uh, one color, and these other colors. Anything that negative should be changed to uh, that color. And that's what we should be marking everything to based on those bends. And then the other bends, I hope I'm making sense what I'm saying here. Oh, I marked the wrong one here. Sorry. I'll save this workspace for you. I'll make this yellow. And the other one's this one here. It's purple. So if you have a template that marks from one side these two bends, and the other template marks these four bends, these five bends, sorry. Is it about five? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven bends. So 
two and five, you on the the part that's that's um, three doesn't matter which side they do it as long as because uh, the holes are the same. As, remember I show it here when I flip it here, these holes are in the same location, all right? They're literally a few thousands apart. It's not it's not critical. So on the three on the three, it doesn't matter which side they do the the bend marks as long as one side only has these two bends and the other side has these five bends. Then the, for the three A, same situation, but they've got to make sure that they're marking the top only based on whatever you did here. Um, two here and five here. And then the other one, notches on the other side. Again, they got to look at the holes, make sure it's top. They got to make sure that they know which ones are 3A and which ones are 3B. Um, if I take this, I'm going to just take one, one more thing here. I'm going to take this, copy. I'm going to rotate that, this, this one here. Rotate. 180. And I'm just going to dynamic move. See if the holes are still the same. Mm. The holes are the same, but the bend marks are opposite. Yeah, so you, again, I'm just going to just move this guy over here out of the way, delete it. Delete month. So a template again, uh, I would make it with a template that has these two holes, Shona, and the notch. So you're going to make one template for this that has no notches. It doesn't matter if they mark these two bends on one side or the other. Um, this one here, you have to mark it only one way, and then this one the opposite way. Otherwise, they won't they won't uh, be right. So. This one doesn't matter which side they mark with the two bends as long as the other side has the other five bends. This one you can choose um, to be 3A. This one you can choose to be 3B. The red, the blue, and the red. I'm saving the workspace. Hope that makes sense what I'm saying. Save as. I'm going to save as in the folder I just talked about here. Right here. I'm going to save it, or put the phone down for a second, then type for Shona to make bending templates. Save. And you can see here, save. No. So that's in this folder. And today's date, the 22nd, sorry, the 17th. And like I said, um, make the template. A template can be something as simple as this, Shona. Uh, here to, let's say, here, like that, All right? And then it's one, this one here. To this one here, and then put the the well have the pins welded in here, so that it just locks into place. They can't me mess it up. Okay, so put holes there so we can put the bolts through, and uh, we can weld the the bolts right to the to the into the parts so that it just when they put it on it goes right in. They don't have to worry about having bolts and stuff. The bolts will be already welded into the templates. I'm gonna undo what I just did. And then this one here, um, you're just gonna have a rectangle, just rectangle from here to here with the two bolts. And uh, somehow you have to make it so it's they when they turn it, they're putting the marks in the right spot. So I have to let you think about how to do that because again, this part is symmetrical um, from both sides, but they those bends have to be put in only one way because 
if they flip it the wrong way, they'll have the wrong bends, like this one here. If they flip it the wrong way, they're going to have the, the bends in the wrong spot. So, can you think about how to do that? Maybe, um, maybe uh, make two templates and paint them different colors, maybe? So that they always have red up. Yeah, okay. All right, Shona. And then uh, for the top and bottom, you have to you have to have maybe red on this side and the template on this side would be blue. All right, so they have only have blue facing up and red facing and red here. Okay, there, so there it is. Save as again, save as Shona. Save, and that's it. All right, see you in the morning.